In this video, we are going to discuss about post layout simulation of universal gate using microwind and DSCH. For this, first open DSCH. Here in this place, we have to draw a design. First, I am going to draw the NAND gate. We need PMOS. Two PMOS are in parallel. Making right. just flipping. Then two NMOS. And in series. To give the connection without overlapping, I'm going to flip this. So click flip. Then we are, we need output port one. Then we need inputs. Two inputs we require. Then one VDD and one ground. We'll take the wire, give the connections. So here I am editing the properties of clock. Here I am changing the on time file. Then click here run simulation. So stop here. Then click the timing diagram. Will be output for this and as well as zero zero means and it is one zero one one zero one one it will be zero. So this is the output waveform for the NAND gate in this schematic level. Our aim is we have to draw the layout that is automatic generation of layout for this from this schematic we have to generate the very log file so first i'm going to save this file go to file click save us okay. nand nand again save then we click file make very log file now automatically the very log test file not txt file will be created with the file name of 
NAND gate. Then click. Okay. Then open the microwin. Click compile. Compile very log file. Here go to this uh, micro folder. Previously that is NAND gate dot txt is a very log file. Then click open. Then click compile. Here the automatic layout created with the help of this test with the input and output then click run simulation so we are having input clock 1 clock 2 are the inputs here it is 0 the clock will be like this next clock will be double time so 0 0 means now we will be having 1 1 0 1 0 1 1 then 1 1 output to be 0 this is output for the NAND gate this is time versus voltage versus time this is voltage versus current plot here this is the voltage versus voltage that is clock as well as out this is the frequency versus time this I diagram representation of NAND gate so next we can see how to draw the NOR gate using DSCH. I am going to take two PMOS first. Two PMOS are in parallel. So two, two PMOS are in series and two NMOS are in parallel. For making the diagram with the overlapping, I am flipping this PMOS and this also. PMOS and NMOS, I am flipping on PMOS and NMOS. And take for output function. This is for VDD. This is for ground. Then input clock, here is next clock input, or we can say B and B. Then take the wire, We are also changing the properties of clock and making two times faster. Then click OK. Then run here. So automatically the test bench give input. We can see the response in the graph, the timing diagram. So this is the response of this clock. So next. Go to file, your savers, click savers and giving the name now gate save go to file make a very log file now a very log file is created then open the micro wind click compile compile very log file click NOR gate open so this is the where lock mode for the NOR gate then click compile your layout was automatically created with the test bench with the input based on the schematic diagram then click run simulation Compile so uh, go to simulation 
voltage was a stand. So here for NOR gate, 0, 0 means 1. For other, another case, all other case, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, we will be getting, output will be 0. So the same thing will be also repeated. This is the voltage versus time. This is the voltage versus current plot. Then this is voltage versus voltage. This is frequency versus time. This is the I diagram for this. NOR gate. Thank you for watching.